Yeah, I know. Listen, don't be mad at me. Second dinner has forced my hand with this deck. You see, in yesterday's over the air update, Hellcow went up to seven power in exchange for losing one of its discards, which is a pretty substantial nerf intended to target Hella decks. I'm not sure it's worked. It looks like people are still playing Hella with some degree of success, and uh, it's still pretty popular, unfortunately, as well. But how this relates to me is that a few weeks ago, when Hella was previously nerfed, because she just keeps getting nerfed and it's not doing the job, and at that point they moved her to give your cards negative three power, I made a joke tweet about a Cerebro 7 Hella deck, because Hella's at seven. If you have things debuffed by three, any 10 power cards go down to seven. So you can, you know, have Hella at seven, Sasquatch at seven, Eliath at seven, Black Cat is very common in Hella decks. It goes down to seven. So it was a joke, because it's obviously worse than Luke Cage, right? You'd rather have a 17 power Infinite pushed back to 20 with Luke Cage than a seven power Sasquatch pushed back to nine with Cerebro. Clearly a terrible, hilarious meme idea. But now they've moved Hellcow to seven as well. And I was like, okay, listen, I actually have to try this. It's still obviously just gonna be worse than like Luke Cage and stuff, but but here's the scoop, okay? This stupid Cerebro seven Helladeck, I actually went six and six and had a plus five cube run through my first 12 games, which is absolutely ridiculous for a total meme deck because it turns out even Hella just summoning like, you know, a couple nine power six drops can be completely insane because that's still like 18 power. And the actual upside on this deck as well is that you're you're kind of playing some big stuff early, you know? You're getting Elkals and Swordmasters and Proxima Midnights and Blades down on board. It's not like you're not doing anything in the early turns and then Hella still comes in. Doesn't have the crazy power output swings of a normal Hella list, but still still does some work and manages to actually climb a little. So no, this is not as good as a normal Hella deck. No, you should not play this. This is a meme. I, I think it's just a showcase of maybe why Hella is a problem. Even when you break it down, you ruin the deck, you turn it into a joke. Somehow it's still competitive and still steals cubes off people and can still do some silly things. So I know you're probably sick of Hella at this stage. You're probably sick of playing against Hella, but I think you'll still find this enjoyable for that reason. This, this kind of like extra little layer of Hella silliness, still stealing games, still winning. It might make you sick, but I think it will entertain you as well because this deck is hilarious and somehow not hilariously awful. Um, yeah, okay, great, uh, great blade. I mean, this is really one of our only good uh, Swordmaster targets. We have Cerebro and Sasquatch sometimes too, which are good, I guess. So maybe if we draw one of those by three, that'd be nice. Sif is pretty, pretty bad in general in this deck. I mean, Parker! I always seem to have Hella in hand, so that doesn't help, I guess. Oh, bro, there's the Sasquatch, but I can't play a card this turn, so I gotta wait until I'm like four. I guess we'll play Hawkeye on three. Uh, Cerebro would also be a good draw. Oh yeah, nice. Okay, Cerebro's a great draw. This kind of fills the, the curve gap. Uh, now, the, the Swordmaster might unfortunately hit this Hawkeye because she's three, but we got a 50-50 maybe. Cosmo, uh, that's a bit of a pain. Is this a C3 deck? Are we, are we playing a Cerebro mirror match by God? I think we still do this now, right? Because uh, we might like draw a Sif and make our chances worse. And we can still play Hellcow next turn. There's nothing better than Hellcow next turn anyway, I don't think so. 50-50 here, pretty big one. Sasquatch the home run, nice, okay. Mystique again, all right. We've seen we we've seen this deck twice today now. Cerebro Mystique against me twice, man. I don't know, Hellcow doesn't care. Just chill. Hella can go left, I guess, I, I don't know. Oh man, would Eliath be an insane hit, man. I would have rather drawn Black Cat now and then Eliath, but Eliath, well, Eliath actually has a pretty low chance to succeed, doesn't it? Because all these stupid Cosmos. Uh, last time we played against this sort of thing, they, they just Cosmoed so much, but they didn't really get enough power now. It's kind of one of them. Yeah, unfortunately, I mean, Eliath is still the, the best target here for sure. There's no question. They do have priority, so they have like, you know, an Eliath of their own or something. Of course, they'll shut this down. They seem to be very mad about Hella. I am 
would Iron be Man. totally surprised. Uh, I mean, we have a, oh home run hit, dude. We have a really good chance to beat this. Oh, no. How do we not beat this? Right? This is the arrow. Oh well, arrow doesn't matter. Of course, the, the cosmos. Yeah, nice, dude. The C9, C oh, C7 really. C7 Helda deck worked. Unbelievable. Honestly, pretty good numbers too. If you look, 27 and uh, 30. Like really nice. Very good positioning. We only needed one of these i guess here uh dude i can't believe it actually worked <laughs> i can't believe it worked that's pretty good uh, you know not bad not as good as regular hello i'm sure but not bad not bad all right yeah pretty terrible hand none of our early game can still be saved right oh well um save me sunspot yeah Sunspot, we need to get you to exactly seven, dude. <laughs> I mean, at this rate, it may not be that hard. I got nothing to do. Any three drop, please? Any any of them? I guess Vision would be... Uh, oh, okay. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Cerebro's awesome. Yes. Okay. We're back in this, dude. Now we need um, Black Cat. Just get a Black Cat. That's great this turn. Goliath is a good hella card i mean can we just win with professor x mid by the way and just do like Eliath left or something you know what i mean like are we just gonna cheese this game oh <laughs> scratch that okay i i really trust you sword master dude i really trust you so much you're gonna hit Eliath every time sword master i know you are but you can't hit Eliath. you're gonna hit sasquatch every time every time sasquatch Bad. That's a one and three snipe, dude. That's not bad. That's not bad. Oh, Black Cat, you're a turn late, though, you idiot. Black Cat, you fool. This needs to hit Eliath. Uh, well, I guess Black Cat's the same. We don't have priority, so it's the same difference, right? Do they move the blob or do they keep the blob? I think they're gonna. I think they're gonna adhere to the old, uh, the old advice that blob can't move, even though he can. They're just gonna say no. Blob can't move. Nobody can move the blob. And we're gonna we're gonna hit we're gonna hit uh, we're gonna hit uh, Black Cat or Eliath, and we're gonna have some big numbers. Right and left, they never move Blob. I'm just like a, I'm a hundred percent certain to, to be honest. I just know they never move the Blob. Somehow you just feel it in your bones. <laughs> God dang it! Oh, oh, we can what? Oh, we can still beat Blob easily right here. We just need a good summon at all. Even Vision's fine, dude. It breaks our cerebral. To me. Uh, that's fine. Yeah, easy. easy. Oh no, Vision doesn't break our cerebro, you idiot! It's not actually eight. It's five. Even better. Perfect. Victory. That actually did matter. We needed the we needed the cerebro buff here. Wow. Cerebro Hello wins again. Why does it win? <laughs> it shouldn't ever win. Yet it wins again. Okay. Oh, Nexus. Uh, kind of scary, huh? A good Sif currently. I can hold this hand. Black Cat's out of here. See ya, Black Cat. We'll miss ya. What's my thumbnail for this gonna be? Probably something Swordmaster related. I feel like I've never made a Thor Swordmaster thumbnail. Seems pretty cool. Ooh, Elysium. That does... Oh, dude, why do you always show up at the exact wrong moment, Hella? Always, Elysium 2 makes it... Ugh. All right, well, we're going to hit a 50-50, I guess, because what else can we do? Nice! Elysium kind of kills Swordmaster, though. A lot of dead draws here, like Blade's kind of dead. Uh, okay, well, the game knows what it wants. The game knows what it wants, dude. Eliath, here we go, dude. We're just snipers. Let's go. The game knows what it wants. We give it. We feed it. It is a monster. It must consume, and we feed it. The hella machine. Uh, it's an easy Eliath here. No questions asked. Easy Eliath. Easy, easy. <laughs> so this is... It's just what it's like to be a hella player, by the way. Oh my god, it must be nice. Oh well, no. Okay, that one's done. We could with Elysia we could play that whatever though, so we could just chill on that for now. Uh we need to draw like I mean I guess Cerebro's pretty cool to be honest. I, that would be nice. Um 
I guess an arrow at this stage would be pretty good since we got the Hella Blade. Yeah, we only have two draws left, right? So like Hell Cow won't be any good. So it's best draws are probably Arrow and Cerebro. If, if we hit Cerebro, this will almost certainly be the first game in the video. So you, you might already be spoiled and not know it. Oh God, what is this gonna be? Is this like Spectrum, dude? What, what's about to happen? It's gonna be a Spectrum. Holy crap, Eliath mid could totally ruin them here. Totally. Oh, Jubilee, huh? The problem with Jubilee is that if it hits Arrow, it breaks a Cerebro. Now that said, we don't have... We don't, we don't have a, uh, you know, a Cerebro at the moment. So I think it's okay to play this. I think it's fine. If it hits Arrow, like, so be it, whatever. We might actually mess up this already. I think this is more for Spectrum, to be honest, but you never know. And then... Um, you know, whatever. Let's just hit like a hell cow and it's not a problem, you know, or Proxima or Cerebro. It's three out of four great results. Naturally, we hit the one garbage result. So. Uh, alas, you know, alas. So, Cerebro here would be really sad now. Of course. <laughs> of course. So, we really want to, we really, oh, we can actually just. Play all these, huh? We 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 really 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 want the Eliath to go mid, so I'm gonna do this, dude. This is so sad. Imagine if this was a Hell Cow. This game would be absolutely perfect. But we really want Eliath to go mid, right? So that it shuts down this Spectrum. Otherwise, I don't think we can win left. So gonna stuff up here slightly increases the chance because we've had three things discarded. If like Black Cat and Sasquatch go right then Eliath is forced mid, you know, it may, it may not work out that way. It's a 50-50 really, but a little better odds this way, I think. Um, Minions Eliath mid, baby, come on, minions. come on, no! Well, they didn't play a Spectrum anyway, so I don't actually know what's gonna happen. Hey, but I think that Darkhawk's gonna get too big, hey, is what I think. I found a uh, this game was so hey, close to being amazing, and instead it turned into utter garbage. Which a makes sandwich. me very sad. Wait a minute, are we still kind of winning? Oh no, they have, oh wait, dude, oh, no. <laughs> How do we win, Victory. what? I was expecting a rock slide to murder me, but, dude, <laughs> dude. Should I take Jubilee out of this deck is the real question, man. It feels like so important for Hella to find Hella sometimes, like desperation, you know, dig deeper into your deck, so. It's really sad. I mean, we had a three out of four, right? This was a 75 percenter. This Eliath was 50 plus. Again, I don't know exactly what it was, but slightly better than 50 percent. Tiny little bit better to go mid where we cared about it. Although it ended up being great right, so maybe I'm not mad. I don't know. This hazmat would have kind of blown us up. How do you not play hazmat here, by the way? I guess they were going for rock slide. They had three cards in deck. I would have tried to play it here, though. I don't know, dude. Oh, okay, great. Uh, well, no, dude, dude, we're drawing a card. I do this literally every time. I'm like, oh, great blade. Let's play it. <laughs> it's like, well, whoops, that's hella, dude. No, you can't do that. So, yeah, we're really looking to top deck like Eliath, Sasquatch, or Arrow here for this blade. That would be dandy. Arrow's great. Opponent's saying something. I'm just going to start using this emote. This is how you guys will know it's me. But then I'm giving all my imposters the, 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 the data they need. Oh, Regis says he always uses the Spider-Man, symbiote Spider-Man emote. Okay. I know the scoop. Uh, yeah. That, missing a three sucks for us, actually. We have a few threes we kind of like to play. Uh, there's one of them, sadly. Maybe we still win this, but you kind of think Vulture's always going here. Maybe you just put the Helic out here because you don't really expect to draw. Next turn, I guess it's Cerebro. I don't know. Black Cat would be a great draw here. Just like draw Black Cat and Loser, you know? Um, this move deck gets a lot of big numbers, which is very scary. Uh, Sif obviously is really bad right now. Do I move this here? I think it's bait, right? I don't, I don't think so. <sighs> yeah. I mean, we're not, we're not in a great spot. We have Arrow and... I mean, we hope to hit, I guess, a Sasquatch or a Proxima. Dude, this is absolutely obscene, by the way. Like, what are you... Stop doing all this. What are you doing over here? Stop it. Please. You're embarrassing us. We just drew everything in the wrong order, man. 
Uh, this like has to hit the left two cards to be any good. And I don't think it's still enough. <laughs> like we just didn't get enough juice in the tank here. These numbers are absolutely obscene for this move deck. That said, I don't know how much like flexibility they have to move out of there other than just the one Madam Web, I guess, right? But maybe, maybe Torch moves, he's 12. That probably wins right always. Uh, I don't think Arrow will be disruptive enough here. It might be better off going hella right, to be honest. Like maybe you just kind of trust mid gets enough cards because they can't really play that much, presumably. I wonder if that's true. Like just kind of hope to dodge mid, you know? I wonder, man. I wonder. Maybe three mids enough and then the hella bonus right makes the difference. I mean, it might still roll mid, sure, but I, I don't know. I, I don't think they're going to get a ton of cards mid. I think they want to move like Vulture right and then play Heimdall right, but you the Heimdall sends the Vulture mid, which doesn't win you Mojo World. Maybe they put Heimdall mid in that case. Maybe maybe then I need the fourth card. God, actually now I've talked myself into that. Okay, we're, we're back again. <laughs> I don't know. We're back again. Heimdall mid makes too much sense. So or or Torch, whatever it is, right? Vulture or Torch. The, the, the key being four cards mid is a significant advantage here, maybe. Because they end up... Oh, but there's also Symbiote Spider-Man. Oh, no, nah, dude. No, nah, I don't know, man. I don't know. This is fine. I'm not going to mess with it again. I'm just too late. But... Okay, they actually played a lot of cards. All right. Strange hits the Vulture. The That's really big. Does Arrow here mess them because it pulls the Strange elsewhere? Oh, and the Multiple Man can't move. The, the Arrow... Oh, that's a good roll! Does Arrow left win this? To <gasps> me. Oh, it's oh no, it's multiple man. No, I was thinking Strange was last. No. No. We needed we needed Strange and Sasquatch to go left. <laughs> Dude, this is not a lot of power, by the way. <laughs> Which is not a surprise. We kind of knew. But just looking at it, it looks a little depressing compared to the opponent, which is good. Good. Please, God. Help. Hella is making me suffer, as as perhaps it should. Uh, Yeah, let's wait on the blade. Black Cat's going to take care of herself. That blade might be a nice bonus. So we do have a bunch of rocks, but if Hella already... Uh, I mean, if, if nothing else, Hella Black Cat is a play. I do not want to go for Jubilee here. Rocks? Okay, rocks are good there. Yeah, here's a Sasquatch. Swordmaster is a way to hit Sasquatch if I play... Or excuse me, uh, yeah, well, no, that won't work. <laughs> the only way to get Sasquatch to five is to play a card now. If I play a card now, is it a Swordmaster Blade? If it's Swordmaster, I can't Swordmaster Sasquatch. If it's Blade, I can't Swordmaster Sasquatch. So let's just play the Blade is what we're, what we're hearing here. Maybe we'll draw an arrow here for the, uh, for the Swordmaster. This Jubilee is a bit risky. We have um, Arrow and Eliath in the deck, both of which would disrupt the Hella Cerebro. That said, we don't have a Cerebro right now, so I'm not that worried about it. And it's only a two out of like, wow, what do we got? Nine cards in deck now with rocks. So I'll take a two out of nine for sure, not a problem. That's totally fine. That's great, actually. Cerebro would be pretty good, by the way, right now. Uh, let's just do this. Tempo Swordmaster. I, I don't actually think we're winning this, right? Like, so it's enough to contest it, but I'm just kind of trying to isolate positions here for a better Hella, essentially. I think the opponent has a much better Hella than us, though, because they're a real Hella deck. <laughs> we're, we're a garbage, garbage Cerebro Hella deck. I can't win, right? Like, what if they discard it? They have Hella, they just snap. They've only gotten a Death Gone, though, right? That's not that bad. I don't know, maybe. We got two tens, they got a 12, but they're winning right already, so feels feels easy. Minions uh, to me. That mid beats us, I guess, Minions right? Oh! To me. Dude, the confidence on the snap here is wild to me. Victory. It's wild. Even a even a death mid would have been fine, actually, because we, we got the Atlantis bonus here. We couldn't lose this, maybe. Well, no, no, I guess death mid and like rock right or whatever. Death left also, I suppose. Oh, no, no, death's only nine. I mean, if death left and we miss left, I guess beats us. Yeah, Yeah, I don't, I'm surprised by the snap there, dude. They must have just seen the hella and snapped, but... um, Yeah, we're just getting these weird little wins, man. Weird little wins.
Okay, not a bad start. We really want to get like a blade down early, a cerebro. Oh, fine, fine time for a blade as far as I'm concerned. Maybe we try to send this left, actually. The 50 50, I guess. Fine time. Uh, you know, the, the, the proximate getting pulled by a non, like, you know, you, you don't, well, you, you want, you, <laughs> I swear to God, I'm going to say something that's actually in English if you give me a try. <laughs> Proxima is never resummoned by hell is what I'm trying to get at. It's not coming out very well, but that's what we're trying to get at is Proxima is never actually resummoned by hell, right? Proxima, anytime she gets discarded, she's just summoned. So she's seven. You don't have to worry about her getting the debuff, is what I'm trying to say. Neighborhood Very poorly. So this is so, so far great, great Cerebro setup. If we find Hella, dude, like we're just over the moon. Right now. Uh, I don't know. Without Hella, like this would probably be the play. Like you, you probably just want to win this. I, I don't know though, man. I'm, I'm worried about like Magneto later too. Like all my stuff gets pulled by Magneto, so it's tough to say. Uh, Jubilee. Huh? I mean, I guess we play Jubilee if it hits like Sasquatch or Arrow, Opponent and then we draw Hella. We're really sad, right? Do we Hell Cow first just in case of Hella? Maybe we probably play Jubilee here always. I kind of actually hate the, the the Sentinel in hand. It's it's bad. Of course, it's not good to resummon off Hella. Uh, we got the arrow, so that's that's gonna kill any any uh any Hella play. Oh, Bob moving out though. Okay, I mean they can still move into that, right? Dude, Goliath here is insane, right? It's insane. Don't get destroyed. Oh no. It don't matter. <laughs> Let's go, dude. This game, like this is garbage. I will say like the one thing about this deck over a normal Hella deck is it's not as reliant on Hella. Like the Hella is a lot worse, but it does play cards early. You know what I mean? Like, it, you know, we, we, we get a Proxima, we get a Swordmaster, we get a... Uh, you know a hellcat like there's still some bodies down, you know, okay So decent discard targets in hand, but of course this does not discard them that does discard arrow, which is good Arrow cerebro, you know are kind of the key targets for for sword master like technically of course sif and blade also get in the mix But you're hopeful that you play those instead of your sword master, right? I mean really you're not hopeful for anything because this is a meme but <laughs> you know, it's Treating the meme like it's real anyway, that's your hope uh, oh, that's a great Cerebro spot. Okay, so we have Swordmaster into Jubilee here. Um, Jubilee is like a little risky in this deck. I don't know, man. I'm like thinking about cutting her. It's like, again, it's a meme, so it really cares, but like technically a little risky. Um, maybe we go Sif now to start because, you know, the, assuming the Hella, of course, these are still at seven. We're still happy. Um,. This way, maybe we can dodge the Jubilee this game. I don't, I don't know if that's actually right. We, we really don't want to play a Sasquatch, by the way. Oh, Swordmaster can hit Sasquatch now, which that's actually fine. That, that's okay. Um, That's not a problem at all. I kind of forgot Sasquatch will occasionally, and in fact, often be an odd cost card, which is pretty cool. I, I didn't even plan that. That was just kind of a nice bonus. Really just thinking about big tins, you know, like the biggest tins we have in this deck. Uh, now see, we play arrow here, we get cooked. And if Jubilee pulls black cat, we get cooked. But if she pulls Cerebro, that's the only way we're gonna get a Cerebro. So she pulls blade, that's okay. Pretty good hits here, Hellcow also just fine. Really only black cat sucks. Hellcow's great, that's fine. Um, We want the Hellcow in this case to hit the arrow though. Oh, that big old Ant-Man, big old strong guy mids, tough, tough. We have no Cerebro. Uh, this is, this is, uh, this is not, not, not useful. So it's, it's, uh, oh, 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 not the right order, bro. I don't think we're going to win. Does the black cat, black cat goes after the Hella, right? Yeah, bad, worst, worst time to draw the black cat, realistically. Uh, Proxima is also bad. I mean, it's fine, but it's not there. Minions to me. Uh, Sasquatch, Elioth, wrong spot, no good. Pretty good numbers. 
opponent must be very confused by the way. Like, why, why is this not an infinite? Bro, 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 if this were an infinite, you would have won this game, bro. Why don't you have infinite? Is probably what they're thinking. It's a great question. Uh, you're asking the right questions. Yeah, I mean, actually, uh, we're, we're fine getting rid of Alliant. Yeah, we're, we're going to find Hella, right? We trust. We just have to believe. Because if we don't, we we probably just don't win. So, why not? Got Why can't go on two? Okay. So, pretty pretty good Hella already, right? 21 power, Alliant. Oh, that's not good. That might be my Hella they get. I also just lose a draw. Fina is pretty cool. I mean, it, it probably breaks the Cerebro, but kind of sweet, right? Speed's not bad either, dude. Speed's... We, we, we could get this to six, I guess. To chill on the on the Cerebro Hella. I don't know. We don't have a Cerebro in, in play yet. So, do, do you go speed? No, nah, I don't think you go speed. You, you still go approximate here, right? Next turn's probably Cerebro Vibranium. And you still trust the Hella. I, I, I don't know if they got it or not. You know, we'll, we'll have to see. Cosmo. Okay, we dodged that. That's good. This goes mid. Cerebro Vibranium. Sasquatch does make Cerebro a bit worse. If we wanted to play this game straight, we could do this, but the problem is speed's already at seven. If you get a Hella, we, we, we break the Cerebro, right? I'm, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to stick to the Cerebro for now. Because speed is the one thing that potentially breaks us. If I don't see a hell of this turn, I have to make a tough call, right? Like, I'm probably going to play, like, Sasquatch or speed and say, screw it. Oh, there's no hella. Okay, that made our decision a lot easier. They hate hella. They they are not hella fans. So we'll just go, like, Sasquatch in that case. Oh, dude, that's so sad. She showed up, and I, I just missed my chance. I mean, dude, this is actually kind of cool, too. If I hit, like, Hell Cow, I can still protect my Cerebro a little bit. Uh, like, Hell Cow or Swordmaster. I don't know if it's worth it, necessarily, though. Because I float here, and I would be floating next turn. This would stay at 7. I mean, I can also play Sasquatch next turn. But if I get anything other than Arrow... Well, I guess Jubilee sucks, too. There's my Swordmaster. Okay. Okay. Yeah, we got arrows. Shoot. Yeah. Uh, probably gonna go Hella here just because it makes speed slightly bigger. Well, I don't know. 19's not nothing. I think 18 is a pretty common number for this deck, though, right? So maybe 19's actually better. Yeah, it's probably a bit better. Still up quite a bit left as well. I don't know, man. They, they went so hard on countering that. Oh, I am gonna lose two left though right because currently speed so i'm actually only at 13 left but that's still a big lead that's still nine most of their cards are four power i mean there's like iron man but he's not very good left iron man's good mid but if you're playing iron man mid you're not winning left or right that's just not gonna happen well they might have a good vibranium too like iron man left vibranium right doesn't win though that's nine to eight um hawkeye cards are fine but not good with iron man so you could have maybe a series of hawkeye cards right I don't know. I don't. I don't think this is trivial for them at all, to be honest. How many little four power guys can they get down? I guess is the thing. And how impactful can they be? Grappler into the vibranium. Okay. And the kitty pride. Yeah, four is not enough. Kitty pride, hilariously, not the four you expect. Yeah, they went so hard on countering the hella here that they kind of just forgot to do. You know, well, not forgot, but like just weren't able to. Let's say we weren't able maybe to really develop a meaningful amount enough power. Sasquatch shifting that the, the Sasquatch didn't matter because it's already had two. So, yeah, a weird game for us, you know. Like, man, it would have been a really cool game again if it weren't for the Cosmos. Uh, we're 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 paying the price for the real Hella decks sins, but somehow we're still not losing that much. This is kind of alarming.